New concerns in one local area worried that tomorrow's rains could bring a return of flooding like this. It happened in the same spot just last year. We're talking about the intersection of Roselle Street and Dunhill in Sorrento Valley. It is right next to the coaster station and new at six. Our 10 news reporter John Horn reveals the simple fix to the problem they want the city to take. The city just put up subject to flooding signs along Roselle Street in Sorrento Valley. And the people who work in this area say the threat is all too real. So I was like, okay, I need my rubber boots. I might have to wade through the water. Um, how am I going to get home? Shelly Kilburn knows full well the realities of working off Roselle Street in Sorrento Valley. She's experienced these kinds of floods each of the last few years. Two years ago, it got so bad that it backed up all through this intersection and in the area where for the people that waited too long, they actually had to bring rescue pontoons in. Now she sees the area ripe for another flood because of this over growth in the creek between where she works and the Sorrento Valley train station. This is video she shot of the creek about to overflow in 2016. It's at seven feet, the river. I've seen it go up a foot and a half in the last 10 or 15 minutes, and it's about to go up over the sidewalk and uh, attack Roselle Road there. When that happens, the workers have to take a private road just to get out of the area because access to I-5 is cut off. The growth inside the creek is now almost as high as the pedestrian bridge from Roselle to the train station. When it's overgrown like this, it's not a storm channel anymore. It's a forest. Kilburn says crews actually bulldozed the growth out about a year ago to help prevent future floods, but it wasn't enough. I'm shocked that it's grown so fast so quickly. She wants to see it cleared out again before the rains get too heavy. John Horn, 10 News. The city says it has worked with local businesses to spread information about the escape route. A notice says for safety's sake, workers need to be ready to leave when the rain starts and know the way out.